good day everyone today we got a 820 we need to replace the lcd lcd is completely broken this one we get it with the frame so it shouldn't be that difficult job heat up all the back cover my back cover is already been open it's been replaced the lcd so that's why it wasn't difficult to remove it now we're going to open all the screws and this ring will come out or center chassis will come out now we can remove the same reader or you can do it in the beginning also because without that it won't open stick your nails or you can use this plastic tool also but i use my nail because this one is plastic and it doesn't take that much force there we go it's out and as i was taking out the fingerprint sensor also went out um, we'll remove these this is the main lcd flexi that's the main for the sub for the board we can remove the aerial connector also but because we have to put it with so we we'll try not to disturb it okay it's stuck somewhere here it might be glued so you can heat up if it doesn't come out easy as you can see that it has double sticky tape that's why it was sticking with it so just heat up a bit main board disconnect the battery main board is coming out that is your ear speaker that's about it that's your vibrator if they if you struggle just heat them up a little bit this also had double sticky tape and then i remove it now comes the battery just heat up from this side and the battery will come off according to your force you can see that if you need more uh, more heat or not uh, usually 180 to 200 on uh, your hot air station once it is heated you can use something like this or any plastic tool any plastic tool came out easy you see this has been replaced before so that's why it came out easy now we're going to put everything back onto the new lcd last thing was battery to go out so first thing that will be there then we can put our vibrator uh, we need to put speaker back now on to the old LCD if you look this is a cover small cover which is holding the speaker so you gotta remove that also we place it onto the new LCD and now we can place the speaker in there and uh, now we can put the board and everything back first the blue aerial connector wire will go in there and if you don't put it nicely the middle cover doesn't close the one that popped out like a crown so we have to put it very nice we don't struggle it had double sticky tape it should stick we go back to this corner and press the wire in that will give you a problem while you are closing the phone so we should just be careful that it goes on to its own place
this can stick there now we need to connect the flexes that goes in here you can put a little bit glue under it or double sided tape but I need to test it first that's why I'm not going to under here sometimes it gives you problem it doesn't stick but I need to test the LCD that's why I'm not putting the glue yet first test the LCD then you can put it it's not necessary but sometime it pops up and you can't close it can't close the phone proper we'll put the battery connected back everything is back now we can put our middle cover press it and you can hear the locks closing we'll put our fingerprint sensor back now we'll switch it on it's taking time to switch on let it switch on then I'll show you it's working phone is starting the battery was also very low So it's working looks like everything is okay this is how we change lcd on samsung a20 thank you very much please please i need watch time please give me watch time i got enough subscribers now i need your help guys please please i need watch time thank you very much until next time goodbye a20 samsung lcd replacement now you can just simply put the screws back and put some glue and put the back cover thank you very much bye bye